Whoop-de-doo. What little thingy? You know the little thingy. I don't know what little thingy. You know when like you're talking to your friends on Facebook and it's like boom, your computer's about to shut down. A pop-up? I don't understand. I don't know. Maybe. So it said what? The pop-up said what? The pop-up said the files are corrupted. I don't know what that means, but that's what it said. Corrupted how? I don't know. I'm not the one that's in charge of this. I'm You're not the one the that's computer. in charge of this. I don't understand <laughs> what these things are. I don't either. Okay, so what you're trying to... Let me get this straight. Yeah. What you're trying to tell me is that everything we've filmed is gone. I think so. You think so? Yeah. Well, can you find out for sure? No. Well, I need you Ow. to get on the computer and do whatever you need to do to get them all back. You couldn't do okay. it right the first time, okay, so do it right on. now. Let me, just, let me just do this for you real quick. All right. I'm going to get to fix it for you real quick. All right. There you go. It's all fixed. So what's happened the past couple months, um, our team building got delayed, of course. So uh, Taylor and Mark have been fighting even more. Um, she tried to slap him a second time. That was great. Um, Bren Brenda left. Um, it was like losing a part of the family, I guess. But you know, my dad got a new coaching job and oh bloody, like life goes on, I guess. But moving on to the brighter side, I mean, uh, we have a new student coming today. I think her last name is Bridges. Um, started with an L, so that should be cool. She's joining us on a great day, you know, team building. Hi, I'm Lauren. It's going to be fun. But, um, yeah, we'll see how it goes. Today is the first day of our team building sessions, and in order to save money, the school has decided to hire a former student, which means they've hired an ACC student. Scary Mary was this one mental head case that used to go to our school. <laughs> this is going to be so much fun. I'm, ex I'm so excited to see how this goes. I really don't know how to describe her. I do. She's crazy. That was really nice. Everyone seems nice enough. They don't seem too excited about this whole team building activity though. Of all the people to leave school and study counseling and mental health, I did not think that it was going to be Scary Mary. She used to run down the hall and scream like, I'm cuckoo for Go Go Puffs! And at, like during the National Anthem in a game one time, she pulled a Chicken Little. Um, she used to go around to couples in the hallway and like glue yardsticks in between them. She used to run down the hall and scream about how Barack Obama should never be president. I don't know, it's a whole long list of things, but she was crazy. Oh. Hi. <laughs> Uh, I'm Mary Wilson, former Viper, although I'm not really too fond of snakes. Although they are fascinating creatures, until you look at them through a magnifying glass and they bite your face. Anyways. <laughs> I thought spending the day with Mark would be bad. This just makes it worse. Hi, everyone. Nice. Hi, Scary Brad, I'm going to tell you a secret. You're not supposed to call her Scary Mary. I know something you don't know. I have four rules. Love everyone. No violence, no disrespect. And love everyone. That's actually three rules. Uh, you repeated one of them. 
Oh, I'm not actually affiliated with them. Okay, it's time for our next exercise. We're gonna go around the circle and say how we feel about each other, honestly. Taylor, you go first. I can say anything? Okay, well, Martina, I just want you to know that you're the stupidest person I have ever met. I've met rocks that have a higher IQ than you, but you know what? I'm wasting my breath because you don't even know what an IQ is. What's an IQ? Is it like that magazine, GQ? Jamie, you're not in Scotland anymore. Get that in your head. Stop saying, in Scotland we did this, and in Scotland we did that, because you're not there. If you love your country so much, go back. Ouch! Go back to your own country. Play in the race card. Classy. Typical American move, no offense. You know, in Scotland... Oh, I... I guess I do say that a lot. Ouch. I should probably fix that. And Bradley, you are not more attractive than Bradley Cooper. No one mixes the two of you up. You are a complete imbecile, and you're the scum of this class. And Mark, I hate every fiber of your being. You're selfish, you're cocky, and you're not even that good at what you do. Let's be honest, like, that amount of hair gel needs to stop, okay? Because really, really... And that is the end of the first session for today. <laughs> Are you kidding? <laughs> what are you doing? You're Jamie, right? Yeah. Lauren, right? Uh-huh. It's nice to meet you. Nice to meet you, too. How are you enjoying things so far? <laughs> it's definitely different. Yeah. <laughs> like people screaming at you while you eat in your lunch, right? I'm sorry. <laughs> I thought that would be funnier. Yeah, you know. I didn't think you were gonna, like, pounce across the room. It's not the worst thing that's happened to me. <laughs> really? Yeah. That's funny. So how are you enjoying school? It's definitely different here. Unprofessional doesn't begin to describe it. Nope. <laughs> so what are you working on? I promise you won't laugh. No. I'm working on a comedy script. Really? Yeah, for a TV series in the UK. Can I read it? If you want, here. What's up? What's it about? It's about this uh, really, really, really inappropriate uh, a professional newscast. So basically our class. Yeah, it's funny how you can tell that already. <laughs> Is this one Bradley? That was yeah, the one kid? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> He's crazy. Yeah, he is. Did he tell you his whole thing about how Bradley Cooper's actually named after him? Yes, that was actually the first thing he said to me. Yeah, it's the highlight of his life. <laughs> Is this you? Maybe. Will you write me in? Yeah, sure. I mean, if you want. Yeah, if it ever airs, you should definitely get a pretty actress to play me, though. I mean, yeah, I will. Gotta make it a true depiction, right? Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's do a team building exercise. We both found something we agree upon. This is a waste of time. Through our mouths. Bradley, you can go last. I got last save, guys. T Phelps, one of the APs, owed me a favor. I thought I'd cash it in. I'm always in charge. Even when you think I'm not, I am. So, since none of the fun activities seem to be working, why don't we try something a little different? How about we just talk it out, the three of us? Sure. Why not? Good. Okay. First question. First word that comes to mind about each other. Moron. <laughs> my mother doesn't allow me to say the words that first come to my mind. <coughs> Bitch. Okay. Next question. 
What is your role model? That's easy. Brian Williams and Ron Burgundy. Oh, excellent. Ron Jesus. Burgundy is not even real. He's a fictional character. You take that back. Okay. The man's a legend. No. Okay, Mark, sit okay. down. Just sit down, Mark. Calm down. Good boy. Um. Why don't we try saying something nice about each other? Really? Mm-hmm. I like how good of an answer it is. Thank you. Good. I like how Taylor always gets her work done, how she works so hard to make us look good, how she puts up with me, how she's built this program with her bare hands. She's pretty. She's honest. She has a great journalistic integrity. She smells good. Well, I think my work here is done. I've done a great job, I should say. Very good indeed. Thank you, children. So you guys are continuing the documentary? Oh. You're following me to Scotland. Oh, that should be, that should be fun. I think. I really do love them all. They're kind of like a family to me. And Mark, look what he gave me. World's best editor. He even spelled it all right. Oh wait, he spelled my last name wrong. <laughs>